Good morning everybody and on to another video. I'm at Norwood Fisheries today near Killer Marsh. My mate Ryan South running an open match or running a knock up and said did I fancy it. I said yeah why not. I think there's 11 or 12 on us on it. I've drawn peg 13, loads of room because pegs are iffy round up to 19. So there's another kid on 19 so all the pegs round in that bay aren't been drawn. So uh, my approach today is going to be down to me, uh, down to me right, top two and two margins. I've seen a couple of swirls already, so I've just wet a micro from corn. Same long, but it's, it's about a foot deeper, not really tight up to anything. That's 11 metres, that one. I'm going to go top two and one with six mils. Just keep chucking a few there, I'll wait for wait for any activity. Seen a few, uh, seen a few swirls, but it is quite deep, so I'm not sure what there. And then. Uh, 13 metres or 12 and a half metres with the paste line. I haven't got uh, my pellet wag, my feeder, my bomb line or anything because it's a bit snaggy of at far side. So, same as always, if you see them out, things are going drastically wrong. Fishing 11 till 5. I've been here, I got here at 8 o'clock. I messaged him, I said, What time are you going here? 8 o'clock, I'll be there for my rat. I said, All right then, turns away 8 o'clock. He says, I've only just looked, draws not till quarter to, quarter to 10. So, so that's 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 where we're at with that one. So I'm going to start. I'll probably start on the paste long. Keep feeding that, and then we'll see how we're going to judge it with that. So see how we go, guys. Cheers. Don't expect to get this one in, but Ooh. Yeah, I told you that that's top run. Think and regroup. Right. One of the day at what time are we actually on? 12 30. We roll. I've been fishing an hour and a half. The next peg is empty now on pace. I must have had at least 10 there.
different marks. See some action in margins, but you go in and they're not interested. I've not got the heads down yet. I think that's why he's running it. I'm running it till five, so they can get themselves sorted out. Now I'll come back again. I've never fished here before. I don't know the ins and outs of it all, and it's just all well, getting a bit much.
Oh, no. condition, nice fish. Oh, well. Well, we're getting a good run shall we? Plopping a six mil belly, slapping it. Feeding four mil with a cat pump. I'm in pay 11, still catching well on pace. I'm hoping I can catch him up with uh, margin fish. But we'll see. Well, there's a fight. No, come on.
I've had to put float under because it's not a paste float, it's just my margin float. So I can just see it under the surface and then when it disappears it's uh, game over. But they fight well. They fight very well. You can't just get them up and in. Crazy. Indeed. I'm full of fixes down here. Right, over there. I tried up against that leg. They turn up, they're just not interested for some weird reason. It's like it's too shallow. Here in a few now, though. as well. <sighs> Problems I have. Ooh. It's like it's foul, but not. Probably not in mouth then. Right. Right playing. <laughs> Foul, I think. It's costing me time. I might not get it out of it. This side, don't like it, but still count.
back up. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, spare. Yeah, I'll bet.
have to wear your scent in on these Come matches, Ryan. Ah, me. That would face fish, that one, that little one. I've had one like that one, face <laughs> They were on top of it. <laughs> 51 dead, split, even splitting though. Yeah, I've held them ones right, stay on. About a mile away. 14, 14. You've got the magic touch, haven't you? You've got the magic stick. Right. Weighed in. 162, I think. It's only been about 10 seconds to tell me, and I forgot, so hopeless. Um, I'll put sheet up anyway. I think Lee, Leal, I think his name is. He's 170 odd. I'll put sheet up, like I said. Um, started off on paste, got one, that foul up that, lost rig then. And really I probably should have set a, another paste rig up and carried on, because Lee, that's all he's caught. Um, I've rotated lines, I went to me, I tried that edge of peg 12 and you're only about just over a foot deep. And I really, there were fish there but they just wouldn't, they wouldn't, wouldn't take it. So then, Ryan said to me earlier on, he's on 19, right, and he said, go along down your left hand edge. So I went 11 metres and it were a bit, there were some weed and that. So at the end I went to 14 and a half, found a clear, and I've had about six or seven carp there. So that were all right. And then I've come to top kit here, um, put corn on and didn't want it. So what I've done is I've just pulled my float down about an inch, put some paste on so that the float would lift up once it had, uh, once the paste had come off, sacked up, and I, so kept cl kept uh, kept clipping uh, camera when we uh, when we landing that. I'm gonna have to think of somewhere somewhere else to where to put it or what, what to do. I don't want to click them to the side of the side tree, but that's uh, that's it. So cheers, Ryan. Thanks for inviting me. I'll certainly uh, come again. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And we'll see you again. Cheers. <laughs>